Football fan looks forward to a lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you, and part of the story here is the Albite Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Brazil, and they take on Spain. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Lucas Paqueta starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the striker is the very creative and eye-catching Richarlison. Here's the lineup for Spain. Danny Olmo plays with Ferran Torres out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the game begins. Gabi. Marcos Llorente. Gabi. Marcos Llorente has it. Marco Asensio. Now, let's see what they can do here but really sticking to the task defensively. Well, given the form he's been in, Stuart, you would expect quite a lot of the attacking to go through Neymar. I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders. He's got oh, hang on, Stuart, it's a chance! Well, he's placed it wide. Really close, Shane. Well, between 2008 and 2012, Spain were right up there with the very best of international teams. They had their barren spell after that, but you know, Stuart, green shoots of recovery were visible at the last European Championship when they were perhaps unlucky not to make it to the final. You're absolutely right. They've got a manager that likes to bring in the young players. They play a style of football that only Spain can play. They've got some excellent technical players in midfield. They are a team that I think can go all the way. But you have to remember they're in a tough group. Germany and Japan are both very good teams. They're going to have to start this tournament well. It's a splendid through ball from Neymar. Neymar! Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Well, they've started really brightly here. They were so close to taking the lead. He has teammates around him. Might be a chance here. 
There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. And very deftly cut out. Neymar. Richarlison. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Well, opting for the short corner. Paqueta. Offside by a fraction. Marco Asensio. And Torres on the ball. And he takes it away. Vinicius Junior. Now, who can he play it to? Shot attempted. And using his body to good effect. Sergio Busquets. And a fine tackle. Opportunity in the wide area. They could nudge in front. And the keeper has to deal with it. Over it comes. It hasn't come to very much. Neymar preferring the inside route. Well, decent save there. Fancy a short one. Paqueta. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Rafinha. Encouraging move this from Brazil. Really vital interception here. Pedri. Danny Olmo. In the right place to cut out the pass. Eder Militao. Neymar. On to Paqueta. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Paqueta. On to Neymar. Real chance. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Pedri. And the referee sees that as a foul, free kick given. 
Well, he might have been tempted to caution him, but didn't, Stuart. Yeah, and I like that from the referee. It's not a yellow card for me. Asensio. Excellent defending. Could be a chance to break here. Opportunity it is. Palmed away by the keeper. And a touch off the defender last of all. So a corner. Favouring the short one. Marquinhos just couldn't get it through. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. And taken short. Growing pressure here, and another corner. And now the delivery, and the problem not completely solved. Paqueta, could be! No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Ferran Torres. Jordi Alba. Pedri. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Tremendous ball played through. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Pedri. And there it is, the half-time whistle. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Yeah, he's had a good first half, hasn't he? Looked lively, created plenty of chances and rewarded for his industry with that key goal. Hopefully he can keep that momentum going into the second half now. And so the battle commences. Richarlison. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. to deal with it Neymar preparing the inside route well decent save there away by the keeper 
And a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. Just couldn't get it through. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Paqueta. Could be. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? So back underway here. Brazil with the lead. But this game a long way from being done and dusted. Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Well, it's always at the discretion of the referee, in this case, opting not to book him. Richarlison. Here's Vinicius Jr. Richarlison. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Pedri. This is looking threatening. It's a perfect challenge. Vinicius Jr. Now Casemiro. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Oh, blocked it! And snuffing out the danger, but a corner coming up. Playing it in. Rafinha. Marquinhos. Richarlison. Terrific piece of anticipation. Can they hit on the break? And a good looking pass the challenge that was required well they might be onto something being egged on by the crowd Paqueta it has to be oh denied by the post not too fussy in clearing his lines well had that gone in they would be in complete control of this game as it is they're still going to be a bit nervy Yes, so near indeed, but now they've got to concentrate on keeping... A goal! Real excitement! A back-and-forth type of game! Now they're level! Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Gabi. Pedri. Marco Asensio. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And options in the centre. Fabinho. Rafinha. 
He's going forward well here. What a shot from miles out. Terrific block. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Asensio. Juventus must take the lead here. What a vital intervention. Marcos Llorente. Chance to cross. Asensio. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Oh, in with a chance. And nicely parried away. Vinicius Junior Fabinho Oh, he looks threatening Big chance And really tried to blast that one past the keeper But his radar was a bit off Both managers deciding This is the time to change things around Both teams going to the bench And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. Oh, they've done it! They've forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then it's a wonderful strike from Neymar. He hits it with power, he hits it with pace, and he hits it with accuracy. What a goal that is. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Jordi Alba. Danny Olmo. Pedri. Now Busquets. Well, do they have a goal in their future? They're giving it a go. And play halted, free kick given. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Played in there. Not really the ideal clearance. Sergio Busquets. This looks promising. It did look on for them, but not to be. Michel Lasson. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Juventus. Able to deal with the threat. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Thiago Silva. It's all over. And a Spanish defeat. Well, they were hoping that wouldn't be the big story at the end of the game but they haven't got their wish. Stuart, your analysis. 
Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it conceding so late on. Neymar, such a difficult man to pin down, as we saw in this game. Your thoughts on his performance? Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal. And the contest begins. Richarlison. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. to deal with it. Neymar preparing the inside route. Well, decent save there. Touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. Just couldn't get it through. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Paqueta, could be. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Yes, so near indeed, but now they've got to concentrate on keeping going. A goal! Real excitement, a back-and-forth type of game. Now they're level. Oh, he looks threatening. Big chance! And really tried to blast that one past the keeper, but his radar was a bit off. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. And it might be the goal that gets... 